reason I needed to install an RPS solar system is because I've got a pond. We're going to look at a pond in just a second. And the pond is, was fed by two, three small springs. And by August, the springs would be drying up. And the pond fed and feeds into this branch right here. And what we figured is we can recirculate the water from the branch back into the pond, but we're too far away for AC power. Thus, we are in RPS solar. Uh, but the first thing we needed to do was dam up the creek, the branch, so that we could get a place to pump. And so what we did was we built a small dam up top and then a large dam down below. We built the dam out of riprap uh, and various different types of plastic and sand in order to, to, get, the, to get the flow to stop. Um, and then we set the RPS solar pump. We used the 400V inside of a sump pit. And that worked out great. The, no, uh, I mean, it was a lot of hard work, I'll tell you that. Uh, it took us three days of pretty continuous work, but we got it done. For the solar panels and for the, uh, for the mast, we built it out of a six by six and two by fours. Uh, and that was, a, that was a big part of this project. And one thing that we realized, so we got L joists with between the two, two by, between all the two by fours. And then we had to bolt through the two by four without hitting the solar panel. And that was a project in and of itself. You, I, I would highly recommend buying the mast kit. That is, that is hard. Um, the, and then, but I will say connecting the solar pump to the panel, that was relatively simple. Um, and now we are pumping away. So here's the pond, it's about a third of an acre. Right now, it's actually, it looks very good right now because we've had a bunch of rain and also it's still early in the season, so the springs are running. But I'll show you the difference between uh, how much water we got coming in through the solar pump now and what we have through the spring. All right, here's spring one, literally just a trickle of water, and this is about as high as that water is ever going to get uh, after the recent rainstorms. Right, and here is the second spring again. Very, very small amount of water filling up this third of an acre pond. And here's the third spring, moving along. Um, but uh, again, not the greatest amount of water. Now that's what I'm talking about from the RPS system. Thank you, RPS, for making this part of Grayson County, Virginia, that much more beautiful.